Today's video, I'm going to be showing you one of my favorite plays out of Trips Tight End in Madden 24. It's one of the best ways to beat man coverage and zone coverage in this game, and the play is going to be Curl Flat. Now, if you want to get my entire Trips Tight End offensive ebook, I think this year Trips Tight End is probably as good as it's ever been. There's a lot of really cool stuff you can do with the formation. You can get access to all of my ebooks by joining the Patreon by clicking the link down in the description. It's only $10 to be a member, and like I said, it gets you access to all of our offensive and defensive ebooks. For this setup, what I like to do uh, with the play Curl Flat here is we are just simply going to drag our outside trips receiver we're going to streak our tight end and we're going to block our running back the beauty of this concept is going to do a really good job at beating man and zone by creating a essentially high low read on the right hand side of the screen we're able to attack the three levels of a defense on the right hand side of the screen by utilizing the streak to you uh, clear out zones using the uh, post route and then also using this backside drag. The backside drag is actually significantly more effective than any kind of like in route that we would previously use because it is much better and much more consistent at spacing and better at getting separation against man coverage. Now, the cool part about this is once we are able to attack the different ways that our opponent can play man-to-man -man coverage with just the simple drag and the post routes, uh, and of course, uh, as soon as I say that, I uh, throw the pick. Um, but the beauty of this is we can attack man coverage with these two routes. Now, obviously, if they bump into each other, that's one thing. Um, but typically, this post route to Cooper, see how he's getting bumped right there? If he doesn't get bumped with that three rack, the three rack and cover on Robert Press literally breaks everything in practice mode. I'm not really sure why. Um, but uh, anyways... As long as we can throw this, it's going to make them have to make a choice. Are they going to use her the post or are they going to use her the uh, little drag route underneath? So what this is going to do is oftentimes they are going to turn to different coverage strategies. One of the coverage strategies that they're going to turn to is something like a little basic cover three here. And what you're going to see is their user is always going to have to match that deep post route. If the user doesn't match or, or take the deep post route, then the deep post route is always going to be available to us. So because of that, then we're going to be able to actually here to throw this kind of in that little pocket before it gets to that outside quarter defender. And what's also really cool about this post route is it's going to do a really good job at beating any kind of double flat or double Mabel coverage. Now, if you do want to put the running back on a flat, you certainly can. It'll just open up the middle of the field a little bit better. And as you can see, that deep post route absolutely cooks the zone coverage. Now, let me show you what it does to double Mabel, and we'll actually set up a backed off cloud just to kind of walk you through uh, what that, uh, what the curl flat post can do. Now, this curl flat post can be found in other formations, but I do think the trip side in is the best formation that has this post uh, as it is able to provide other routes around it that make it super, super, super effective. But this, this post route from the slot receiver, you'll see when he takes that cut, he's actually going to pretty much always clear a 30 yard cloud flat. And that's from running from the wide side of the field to the short side of the field. So he doesn't even have the maximum amount of space that he possibly could have. So if you think about that from a user perspective, their user is going to have to choose whether they're going to guard the post or the drag. If they decide because they know the route stem and they know that there's no zone in the game that's going to go guard that post, then we can easily just check down to our little underneath drag and get some easy yardage. The curl flat post also poses uh, a really good way to attack curl flat zones in general. If you take a look here to the left-hand side, this uh, little in route is going to, or little drag route is going to get wide open to the inside against pretty much every uh, cover two style covered coverage uh, that you're going to face. A lot of people like to cross man the middle trips receiver. This is also going to kind of take advantage of people that like to do uh, different types of cross manning because they're not going to be able to stop the outside trips receiver and the middle trips receiver with any kind of cross manning. So this just does a lot for your offense, guys. And hope you enjoyed the little breakdown here. This is the curl flat play out of the gun trips tied in formation. If you guys want to get my entire trips tied in offensive ebook, make sure you join the Patreon. I'll put a link to that down in the description below. And uh, thanks for watching, guys.